So to answer this guy's question, pre-workouts have evolved. It's always evolving. New studies are coming out, new ingredients are being launched. Now, if your pre-workout still only has four grams of citrulline, it's pretty much outdated. Now, yes, the scientific studies do say that nitric oxide and blood flow production begins at about four grams, but more studies have come out recently showing the bigger benefits to a much larger dose. So for those of you who don't know, citrulline is a nitric oxide producing ingredient. It increases blood flow, it enhances performance, and gives you that skin splitting pump. Now, in old formulas, four to six grams used to be kind of the standard. Again, that was based on scientific literature back then. The recent studies show anywhere between eight to 10 grams of citrulline is where you get to max out the performance benefits of the ingredient. Like this study in the Journal of Strength and Conditioning Research found that eight grams of citrulline increased reps by 52% in high rep bench press volume compared to a placebo group. Even more research has shown that 10 grams significantly impacts blood flow leading to more muscle pump over that of the five to six gram range. But 10 grams isn't just about pump anymore. It's better blood flow, it's more oxygen delivery, it's more ATP production, and more nutrient pooling in the muscles. That translates to actual performance, not just height. So some brands are still stuck like it's 2017. Research has moved on, and so should you. And that's why we give you a full 10 grams of citrulline in M777. Now a little disclaimer on this. If you do have a sensitive stomach, 10 grams of citrulline is a bit much and it's been shown to cause gastrointestinal distress. It's not a complaint we get often. It can happen to some people, so be aware of that. That's why we always do recommend starting off with half a scoop, assess your tolerance, and go from there. Leave me your questions in the comments section below.